welcome back everybody we are continuing the uh, season six of game of thrones we're on episode four so last episode ended with john executing the people who stabbed him yeah the people who stabbed him i was trying to think of his name Al alistair thorn is the thorn in his side since season one so they're dead and then he gave his cloak to, to ed say his watch is over so he's apparently not in night's nice watch anymore Ooh, uh, maybe he's going to winterfell maybe he's about to do some fighting if he's going there hey well hey. Uh, the the umbers dropped rick and stark off to ramsey well that's the baby with, boy with osha and his head of his direwolf so his direwolf's dead so there's only two left you got ghosts and then you got Arias, who's out in the wild somewhere who knows where it's at uh sam and gilly are riding on a boat and sam's seasick mm -hmm. they're on the way to That's old it. town by stopping at his his home to drop Gilly and the baby off. And then Daenerys is in the hut with the widows. And yep. Tyrion is trying to run the city. Mm -hmm. All he wants to do is play drinking games. Oh, but, but they did get that um, uh, they did find prostitute yeah. who, you know, helped the people with the faces. And the sons of the harpy killed the unsully. Yeah, so they did and find out who was paying them. That which is people from the the other town the other that she had already freed. Yeah. Right. Yep. It's the mentality. All people. the masters, like the masters that. But it's a, it's you. In order for you to be free, it's a mentality. You just can't say, "Oh, your chains are broken," but they free. But yes, in reality, they free. But in reality, they're not because they still bound from invisible chains. That's all they know. Because if you're born in captivity, that's all you know. And then, yeah, Bran went back, saw a little vision of the past history, yeah. mm -hmm. saw his, his dad, dad mm -hmm. at a tower fighting some king's guard. Yeah. And then he kind of yelled at his dad. His dad seemed like he heard him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's interesting. Yeah. So, well, let's get on with episode four and let's see what happens tonight. They have her. I've got a gift for you Recon Stark. Welcome home, Lord Stark. He wants to point to us. We just have to make it to Castle Black. Once we're with John Ramsey, we'll be able to touch us. We'll keep you safer than I ever could. You're not coming with us? Where will you go? Home. The good masters of Astabor and the wise masters of Yonkai, with help from their friends in Volantis, found the sons of the Harpy. I am the queen and I don't want to see my brother. You have started down the path, but you have many miles to go. Peter! Unfortunately, the young Lord of the Vale has a new father to counsel him. Well, of course we don't support the damn Lannisters. I want to know which side you're on. Who would you have us back? Robin Aram. I did what I thought was right, and I got murdered for it. I <laughs> failed. You go on. You fight for as long as you can. My watch is ended. <laughs> you should be shouldn't be decapitated like the first person that, who's dead 
the cap that has eaten up the wall. Technically, yeah. Technically. I gave my life. For all nights to come. They killed me, Ed, my own brothers. You want me to stay here after that? Open the gate! Oh! His sister. Oh, man, not home, but. Yeah! She look like, what? Yeah. <laughs> I met my match. A warm embrace. Yeah. So happy for her. I see the world. I think you should just drop. Oh, really? And play it back. <laughs> we never should have left Winterville. Don't you wish we could go back to the day we left? I want to scream at myself. Don't go, you idiot. I spent a lot of time thinking about what an ass I was to you. Hmm. Damn, everybody. Change everything. We were children. I was awful, just admit it. <laughs> yes, you probably were. <laughs> Occasionally awful. <laughs> I'm sure I can't have been grateful and always sulking in the corner while the rest of you played. Can you forgive me? There's nothing to forgive. Forgive me. All right. All right, I forgive you. What's you my hand for? Oh, oh she drinking now? <laughs> <laughs> You think after thousands of years, the Night's Watch, we've learned how to make a good ale. Mm. Where will you go? Where will we go? If I don't watch over you, Father's ghost will come back and murder me. So will. So will. Where will we go? Back home. There's only one place we can go. Home. Home. Well, should we tell the Boltons to pack up and leave? We'll take it back from them. Oh, okay, my sister girl. She bold now. Oh, okay. How many wildlings did you save? They didn't come here to serve me. They owe you their lives. You think they'll be safe here if Roose Bolton remains Warden of the North? Winter. Winterfell is our home. It belongs to our family. We have to fight for it. I'm tired of fighting. <laughs> it's all I've done since I left home. I've fought. And I lost. If we don't take back the North, we'll never be safe. I want you to help me. But I'll do it myself if I have to. My lady? She a lady, man. <laughs> will you stay here at Castle Black? I will do as Jon Snow commands. You serve Jon Snow now? He's the prince that promised. Oh, forgive me, my lady, I thought that was Stannis. Mm, right? I thought it was Stannis, too. All this talk while she saw him fire and the flame. There was a battle. Stannis was defeated. I'm Shireen. What happened to the princess? We burned her. I saw Stannis' forces defeated in the field. My lady, I'm Sir Davos Seaworth. We've met before. I was King's Guard to Renly Baratheon. Mm. Before Renly was assassinated with blood magic. Mm. He admitted it, you know. Who did? Stannis. Just before I executed him. <laughs> and bold the are. Oh, she tall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's about my side, my height. Like six three, six four. Four. Can you not see? Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's Baelish. Oh, is that his name, Baelish? Or yeah. Baelish? The defender of the veil. Yeah. Uncle Peter! I missed your name, Dave. Go on. <gasps> A 
Falcon. A dear Falcon. Last time I saw you, Baelish, you told me you were taking Sansa Stark home with you to the Fingers. And yet, not long ago, we received reports that she has been married to Ramsay Bolton in Winterfell. On our way to the Fingers, we were set upon by a large force of Bolton men. You take me for a fool. <laughs> Tell me. Yeah? How many people knew of my travel plans with Sansa Stark? I shared my intentions with you. Slander a man in his own home, you might find yourself crossing swords with him. What he gonna do? He looking like he better do something. <laughs> Should we throw him through the moon door? Hmm. My lord, I have always been faithful to House Aaron. Do you believe him, Uncle Peter? Oh, he's an idiot. Lord Royce has served the Vale well. If we could trust his absolute loyalty, he would make a capable commander in the wars to come. You can trust my absolute loyalty, my lord. I think he deserves one more chance. What do you say? Fine. When he... Like, when Bailey's gone there? ...has escaped Winterfell. I expect she's headed to Castle Black, where her brother serves as Lord Commander. But she won't be safe there. We should help her. That was my instinct as well. Our Lord has spoken. Gather the Knights of the Vale. The time has come to join the fray. To invite the enemy into our city. I did. As a clever man once told me, we make peace with our enemies, not our friends. Our queen tried to make peace with the Mosses, and they tried to murder her. We enter these negotiations with open eyes. My own recent experience with slavery has taught me the horrors of that institution. How many days we were slave? Long enough to know. Hmm. Not long enough to understand. Hmm. She's like, she got you there. <laughs> we came here to meet the queen, and instead we're... Remember here? Mm -hmm. We want you to leave Slaver's Bay. Queen Daenerys won't stay in Marine forever. When we last met, I offered her ships, so she could return to Westeros, where she belongs. Just because your master has silver hair and tits doesn't mean she's not a master. True. It's true. Oh. Always been those with wealth and power and those with nothing. That is the way of the world. I'm not here to change the way of the world. Slavery is the way of our world. You don't need slaves to make money. So, here is the Queen's proposal. Mm. Slavery will never return to Marine. But she will give the other cities of Slaver's Bay time to adjust to the new order. Instead of abolishing slavery overnight, we will give you seven years to end the practice. Seven years. In exchange, you will cut off your support for the Sons of the Harpy. I do hope you accept, my friends. You will not receive a better offer. Seven years. To our honored guests. What the freak he doing? He about to piss me off right about now. No, he pissing her off. See if it doesn't taste every bit as good as what came before. Yeah, they're not going to be happy about that. Jemosi Jombagon. Perhaps I should translate for you. We speak the common tongue. You met with the slavers today. I did. Our brothers and sisters died fighting these scum. Now you invite them to our city and drink wine with them. Hmm. Come on, Arterian. You are a stranger here. So why do you represent Meereen in these talks with our enemies? Because our queen chose me as her advisor. We don't know you. We don't trust you. You have made peace with the slavers. We offered terms. No. They're so proud of myself. Those men respect you. They respect me because they know who I am. They know I am loyal, as do I. Promised the slavers they could keep slavery for a short time. Seven years uh, is seven not years. Short time. It's Sean Wine, girl. Come on. 
Victory is a horror that should be ended at once. War is a horror that should be ended at once. You are wrong to trust these men. I don't trust the masters. I trust their self-interest. You don't know them. You don't understand them. Their contempt is their weakness. They'll underestimate us every time, and we will use that to our advantage. You will not use them. They will use you. That is what they do. Yeah, I'm put there. I trust your judgment right now. Yeah, I don't know. That stuff works so weird. Are you getting DeAndre, man? You all right? Why don't you sit and catch your breath? I don't think you could ride the dragon. What? Our queen. She's wild, you know. <laughs> I don't think your heart could take it. <laughs> You'll disappoint her before long. She'll move on. We'll all disappoint her before long. We need each other right now. After we're done needing each other. Oh, I don't want to fight you, Jura the Andal. What do I have to gain? If I win, I'm the shit who killed an old man. And if I lose, I'm the shit who was killed by an old man. Huh. You didn't get much discipline as a child, did you? <laughs> None. <laughs> when Carl Drogo died, she was supposed to come here and join the Dosh Kaleen. That's where they'll have taken her. The Temple of the Dosh Kaleen. What are you doing? It's forbidden to carry weapons in the sacred city. If they spot us, we're unarmed. See what trade is heading for the Western Market. There's a hundred thousand of them down there. We can't fight our way out. We wait till dark, and then we'll find her. I'm very attached to this knife. Uh oh, he saw it. Don't worry, it didn't touch you. You know what happens? I know what happens. I'll do it myself. It's like, I want you to touch him myself. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, no, he get big. He's getting bigger in it. Spray's pretty fast, it looks like. In the <laughs> I should have been born of the Throcky. Hey, that's why I hut right there, right? They do it out in the open. Did you hear Dario? I should have been born of the Earth. They <laughs> gonna get caught. Come on. Anhai fag fasan. Ji okay, Oceani. Kisha nemo salish jira surun jima majin le sosh. Really? Oh my god. He just getting beat. His tail beat. I mean, like, he ain't got no energy no more with the desert. What happened? He tried to throw sand in his face. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, he kept it. I told you. Very attached to this knife. That's all right. If they find a body with a stab wound, the whole city will be looking for us. Distracting from the stab, I guess. Jinak, Lazari, Halerge, Versa, Vaisish, Triseredek, Akathi, Kisha was Halisi, Jine, Kisha was Shasilaki, Vais, Hashhai, Vejvena, Halarun, Yeri, Kishan, Makishun, and a Zegrek and the Sun. Is it Trisme? You give us away. We have to go now. We will never get out of Face Dothrak alive. All we can do is try. 
We can do more than that. And you're going to help me. Maya. Askoya Nisha Galisi. Maya Askoya. If I were to let you leave right now, where would you go? What would you seek out? I'd go to my brother, my husband, my family. Of course. Seeking out your family means seeking out sin. My father was a cobbler. He died when I was young and I took over his shop. He was a simple man and he made simple shoes, but I found that the more work I put into my shoes, the more people wanted them. The highborn like to cover their feet with my time and they paid well for the privilege. I used their money to buy a taste of their lives for myself. Each time I indulged, I felt myself ascending to something better. And one day you walked through a graveyard and realized it was all for nothing. Look at the stranger, verse 25. You're close, but it wasn't a graveyard. It was a feast. I woke before dawn. Everyone else was asleep on the couches or on the floor. And I saw it with perfect clarity. I saw what my sins were. So what did you do? I walked out the door and never went back. Come, let's go and see him. Who? Hey. Your brother. <laughs> You need to stay strong. I can't stay strong. I just want to stop. Plus, you help you. They want me to help you. They want me to help tear you down. And if either of us give in to what they want, then they win. Let them win. Just make it stop. High Sparrow, <coughs> you are beset with enemies, both within and without. What are you doing here? I am advising the king on our current predicament. Leave. I am here to lend my wisdom and my support. Thank you for your counsel, Grand Maester. That will be all for now. Your Grace. <laughs> she really don't like you. <laughs> oh, fart, he go for himself. So, look. And he know he can walk fast and slow. Oh, yeah. Oh, so. Take them dog going to change off his neck and beat him with it. What? Did he just murder her? Mm -hmm. Since I've missed the past several small council meetings, I wanted to speak to you about a few things. I've been thinking about the High Sparrow. We need to be careful in dealing with such a man to prevent things from escalating any further. Isn't that what you just said? Mm -hmm. The master. Not to antagonize him. Just look at me. What did they do to me? To the king's own mother. Well, they strip, they cut your hair, they strip your neck, and you walk through the thing with doo doo on you. <laughs> doo doo. You don't like Marjorie, do you? Whether I like her or not, it's completely unimportant. Mm -hmm. Most important. Oh, I'm glad you admit that. The High Sparrow has no respect for kings or queens. He has no use for the things of this world. He wants to knock them down and replace them with what? With fantasies. Do do. <laughs> There's something I want to tell you. Something the High Sparrow told me. I promised him I wouldn't tell anyone. I am your mother. You can always trust me. Oh, no. The meeting has been postponed on the king's orders. I would have thought we were perfectly clear the first time. You're not welcome. You once spoke of your respect for our father because he understood the necessity of working with one's rivals. My dear. You have been stripped of your dignity and authority, publicly shamed, and confined to the Red Keep. <laughs> What's left to work with? 
The High Sparrow seized power knowing full well we bicker amongst ourselves instead of seizing it back. In a few days, he'll have a trial for me. But before that, Queen Marjorie will make her walk of atonement. Marjorie will repent her sins before the good people of the city. Oh, no. That cannot happen. That will not happen. You've got the second largest army in Westeros. You'll bring them into the city, stop Queen Marjorie's humiliation before it starts, and take her back into Crown custody. The King has ordered me to take no action against the High Sparrow or the Faith Militant. You will take no action at all. When the Tyrell armies come, you will stand down. When the High Sparrow's in custody, or dead, preferably, and Marjorie's back at Tommen's side, do you think the King will be angry at the outcome? But if the King should call on The whole on thing me... will be over before anyone can call on you to do anything. Mm. Of course I want him back. And stand aside, and let the people that took him from you be destroyed. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm right there with her. If it doesn't go as planned, we'll have civil war. Many will die. Better them than us. She better be telling the truth. I mean, for real, for real. Now he's going back home? Yeah. Reek! <laughs> they told me you were home and I didn't believe it. Theon Greyjoy, I said. He's dead. He let you go. Escaped. <laughs> I escaped. What? I came to rest him. He broke me. He broke me into a thousand pieces. I know. You don't know? He sent us one of those pieces. That's why I came for you. <laughs> why did you come here? <gasps> Where else could I go? You heard father was dead and you thought you'd claim the crown. No, no, I only heard he died after we docked. You happened to show up on Pike right before the king's move. I didn't know. You think any Ironborn wants you to be king? I don't want to be king. What do you want? I want to be whole. Look at me! No, I'm Tell me what you want. You should rule the Iron Islands. Let me help you. Ah. Oh. You know who I am? A lord. You've seen my banners. The flayed man. You eat them after? No. And I've seen worse. Hmm. <laughs> you served the Starks. Aye. They put me in chains and put a sword at my throat. So I served them. Rickon's not yours to sell anymore. He's mine. So what use could I possibly have for you? I can give you what you want. And you're sure you know what that is? Same thing men always want. You get... If you get caught, girl... You're a much better talker than Theon Greyjoy. I had to work hard to get him talking. But he talked. He told me everything. Oh. Who helped them escape and how she did it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, look at this. Feed that. All the good people gotta die. Reflex for real. That's it. So wasn't that one of Ramsey's guy that just yeah. came to the gate? Yeah. At Castle Blank, right? Yeah. Did you, did you see his eyes? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Sorry about the food. It's not what we're known for. A letter for you, Lord Commander. I'm not Lord Commander anymore. Hmm. He got his brother. He gonna tell. He got his brother. To the traitor, Ambassador Jon Snow. 
You have betrayed your own kind. You have betrayed the North. Winterfell is mine, bastard. Come and see. Your brother Rickon is in my dungeon. What? We gotta go. We gotta go. She said we gotta go. We gotta go. Your skin is on my floor. Come and see. I want my bride back. Send her to me, bastard, and I will not trouble you or your wildling lovers. Keep her from me, and I will ride north and slaughter every wildling man, woman, and babe living under your protection. You will watch as my soldiers take turns raping your sister. You will watch as my dogs devour your wild little brother. Then I will spoon your eyes from their sockets and let my dogs do the rest. Come and see. Ramsay Bolton, Lord of Winterfell, and Warden of the North. Lord of Winterfell and Warden of the North. His father's dead. Ramsay killed him. And now he has Rickon. We don't know that. Yes, we do. How many men does he have in his army? I heard him say 5,000 once when he was talking about Stannis' attack. How many do you have that can march and fight? 2,000. Mm. Northern families are loyal. They'll fight for you if you ask. A monster has taken our home and our brother. We have to go back to Winterfell and save them both. Mm. I was really saying, what about Stannis, man? But, you know, they live. Fishy, come in here, Drogosi. That's the silver you guys are living. Mori Vandal and Hrazef and Haman. Me chief Vico Varera, me oske mich kishi, me zigere to shon halen. Has Jerry in a staat rector gagana? Me was all do kisha. Vice of tosh halen. Pos for thachi vejo. And in a sacra keana cover. And in a dothra hatifa gin. Me dos halen haki yalani varesha serez yerowa. Said Drogo as his coin madrivue, varesha serez yerowa. My ervento ki venier shilo my. Imagine, Ajin, I can't find the thing again. Okay, send that to Goy. What's my name? What's Khal? I'm a boy called Yeri. Yeri. What's my name? Have a drink. Imagine, I'm having a knock. Huh? Ask Oshar. Say, get your fee! As your zilly calf, as you lucky it are! Yeri was said she. Yeri was driven. Ah, she. Oh, they ain't locked the doors. Somebody locked the doors on them. Uh oh. He like, this is the show now. This is the show now. Huh. Wow. Wow, look at all of them. Wow. Uh -huh. like, what the hell is this one? Hmm. Said, I told you, he's on that. Look, is this first time? Yeah, he, he had no idea. I ain't know the way it's called the unburnt. Oh, you gotta get you a little peek, don't you? <laughs> Pervert. He's <laughs> <You're> so stupid. <laughs> you say you little pervert. You gotta get him a little glance <laughs> of a naked woman. Okay, let me see this. Let me see it again. He's a little bit young and blessed. Yeah, I ain't seen it for a few years. Let me, let me peek at it again. I'll like, never see it again. So that was a good, that was a good episode. She got her bigger army now.
Yeah. Yeah. And that was like, that was all. That was the city. Like, like, each one of them are like there. all of them. Yeah. Like, yeah, they're. They nailed to her quick. <laughs> I'm out of that fire. I'm like, what the heck? So, Ramsey and killed the girl. Yeah. And I was like, I know. They uh, told him what had happened. They yeah, told him everything. But she didn't know that. So. Yeah, no, she didn't She's know. She's trying that. to. Like, I'm like, girl, don't work do with it. Dion. Why wouldn't it work? Why would well, she used, used the same trick on yeah. him that she used on But she didn't know that Dion was broken like he was. Yeah. But yeah, so. Wow. That's crazy. And then, glad. Sansa. 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 I was about to say Sansa. Sansa's growing some. She's Sansa's got a pair. <laughs> she got more pair than she does on dudes up in here. Yeah. But that was really good. She like, I'm glad she made it to Castle Black with with Jon Snow and with that guy. Dormant. He the yeah. yeah. big lady. Uh, free hand. <laughs> yeah, he is a, he is infatuated with free hand. Oh my god! And then when and then the 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 witch never did tell him what happened to. To uh, the, the little girl. She ain't gonna tell me. She's lucky she got saved by the bell. Cause... Yeah, she got <laughs> saved by Marianne there. Cause... Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, she didn't tell him about nothing. She ain't gonna tell him. Cause and Dion is killer. back at home. Yep. He's back at home. At least. That's that. That's that. Is back with her brother. She's with somebody in her family. And Arya must be still out training. Um, and then the, and what's it, King's Landing? Yeah. Everybody is coming together to get the sparrow. You know, I don't think that's going to work out in their favor, but you know, it is what it is. I think the sparrow's playing Tommen. Yeah, telling, he probably is. Telling Tom in one thing. Yeah. Telling him not to tell his mother just so he can come back and tell his mother. Be like, you committed a sin. Be like, dude, that's my mom. You know? Yeah. So, um. Oh, I said Tom and ain't, Tom very, ain't ready for the game. And then Lord Baelish. Oh, yeah. How you gonna try to threaten that man? You don't want to, you sold her off to that dog. Ain't nobody met you, ain't Ramsey. You made that deal before him. But he know, he know that dumb ass. Titty baby will believe anything he tells him. She all he, to the all moon he, door. How about we throw you to the moon door? How about we throw you to the moon door? And he saw. I was just looking here. I'll be paying attention to details. Yeah. <laughs> what is his name? Robin? Yeah, Robin. So Robin's hands are so big. And he's like a probably a grown man playing a child. He definitely grown since the last time we saw he him. He is huge. His hands are huge. He's taller than he almost. I think he's taller than Baelish now. Yeah. Like when we last saw him, in, it was just a yeah. Like season four, he was okay. smaller. Oh my god! That's one one thing with child actors is like they get bigger. Mm, yeah. I'm like, man, that that's weird. You look good. Who's that? Let me kill him off. He kind of look. <laughs> I mean, he was weird sucking on his mama's titty at five. I mean, ten. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, like for real. But uh, that was this is a good one. So it's very interesting to see how it's gonna pan out with this sparrow. Yeah, I'm uh, interested to see what John and Sans are gonna do. Uh, they need to march on um, to Winterfell and take back they 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 land. That's what they need to do. I'm with I'm with her. Yeah. Yeah. Let's come on. I mean me, you got. He talking about he said he got five thousand. Well, y'all need to go bump heads, 
uh, scratch your elbows, back, whatever, bump your elbows with some other people so they can get in with y'all, they're going to take about one to Yeah. Then go to the next and then and kill them. Yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> you can leave time on the law. But that mom, sir, sir, even Jamie, go ahead and kill him. Kill him. Right then and there. She just want to kill everybody. I want to kill everybody. You have a problem with the good people dying. Like, who's the good person to die this time? Oh, shit. The wild girl? Yeah. Ocean. Her. She, I, right. That girl, yeah. Ocean. Ocean. Her name's Ocean. Like the healthy Ocean? I guess. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. I don't want everybody to die. It's just that when you just plain evil and you show your character as being truly evil like uh jamie huh, he's not evil but he's easily succumbed to his sister's manipulation yeah. he's weak jamie is a weak man beautiful man but he weak yeah so, when he's not around cersei he's a lot better person than when he's near cersei yeah but I don't want everybody to die. Not everybody. Just everybody that's not a star or Ramsey. I want Ramsey dead. I want uh Cersei dead. dead. I want Baelish dead. Um that's just three people. Yeah. That's all. I mean, Ramsey got rid of his daddy, you know. Hey. Right. There you go. He off my list too. Uh and yeah, the number one person was Joffrey. So, you know. Yeah, he's been gone. And, you know, he been gone, but at the same time, with him being dead, it kind of like, oh, okay. Well, let's see what these other people going to do. And sometimes they're like, oh, they got a good bone. They go, oh, they got a good D right there. But for the most part, his mama, she needs to die. <laughs> She needs to do because that one selfish. Well, she's selfish. Her character. And I don't know the woman. Her, you know, I don't know who the woman is herself in real life. But her character, she needs to die. I'm just saying. <laughs> this is y'all first time <laughs> joining us. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button and that's always the like give us a thumbs up and keep the comments coming i love the comments i can't always reply to it he be replying to it, but i read every one of them i really do i read every one of them yeah i usually do the reply yeah he replies i i do read them all and thank you so much um and thanks so much for the suggestion of the thumbs up we appreciate that we really do until next time, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.